My name is Slinky the Count. And I have an addiction. I'm addicted to card fight Vanguard Zero. Now, I, I don't expect a lot of you to understand. I mean, maybe, maybe if you woke up late in the crack of night, just, just searching, having nightmares about not pulling any ultra rare cards in a 20 pack. If you, if maybe if you haven't went to sleep with their phone in hand, staring down the last card that you needed to complete your deck. Maybe you don't understand. I'm addicted to the triggers and the change of a feel of battle. I'm addicted to the feeling of making a nerd feel completely overwhelmed and that I have defeated him on every front. I'm talking about Car 5 Vanguard, baby. Oh my god. And recently I've been dedicating a shitload of my time to it. I am an Angel Feather deck player. Yes, I have true culture, you may say. Not only do I have true culture playing my Angel Feather, I have built a functioning great nature deck and that takes time and effort. But nay, nay, did I stop there? I have also built a Battle Sisters deck, a Darker Regulars deck. I have completed hard mode for almost all of my character fights. I wake up at night scratching my neck for that stamina refresh, baby. This isn't your grandmother's card game. This isn't your solitaire or your, your dual links. This isn't your daddy's magic the gathering, all right? This is card fight. We're fighting for the planet Kray, damn it. Me, my vanguard. I stand my vanguard. God damn. I'm, I'm sorry. I was overwhelmed with emotion there. Just take a sip here. Card fight is a beautiful, wonderful thing because you might not have the money that some of the rich kids in Duel Links has. You might not have the super brain know-how and knowledge of all the generations of cards for Magic the Gathering, you know? But you know what? Card fight welcomes new and old players by showing you at least cards that you'll recognize if you're an old player, and then, if you're a new player, boom, 85 free card packs. You just gotta get up to like level five of the game. They just start giving you fucking cards. You can get two super decks for free if you're a new player. One, if you've been playing for a long time. These decks contain 39 cards that you may fucking need, as well as like perfect guards. Perfect guards are a whole new mechanism in a game that I feel like should be in every game. You can play Duel Links and turn one, turn two, your asshole is getting exploded by an evil or a steel swarm. You're getting beat up by an XCs. Your pendulum swinging your dick around. Dude, what if I told you, hypothetically, you have six damage slots, and if you hit those six damage slots, then you lose. What if I were to tell you, if I was bullying you, I got in a bunch of attacks early in the game. You're at four damage. I'm at two damage. You attack me. They have one safeguard calls a heal trigger. You can heal damage, all right? What the fuck? So then you can just heal a damage as long as you have more or equal damage to your opponent. You can hit a draw trigger to increase your hand strength. You can hit a critical to do two damage instead of one damage and they even have a stand trigger, which lets you re-stand a unit that you already attacked with and slap them in the face with it all over again. Now, these perfect cards, they basically save you from just getting your butt toggled, boys. Alright? You slip through your four of those into your deck, and you grip that with an iron fist, and hopefully, if you're lucky... Whenever they come to clap your cheeks and it's the last damage that you need, you, you just throw it out there. Just salt bay it on them.
Alright. These mechanics are some of the things that drew me in and captured and suckered me into this game that I can't stop playing. Not to mention free events where I can earn more cards and they look super pretty and the animations are so good. Oh my god. Some of these cards animations look so good. Some of their attack animations look amazing. Some of them just look dope. But, uh, I guess this was just, you know, my confession of, uh, my problem with Cardfight Vanguard. Zero. If you like this, comment, like, subscribe. And, uh, if you are too suffering from this affliction we call Cardfight Vanguard, tell me what you're playing with. Tell me how to improve my cards. Tell me your pull rate. What's your way of getting good gotcha pulls? I save up up to 30 tickets at a time and dump them. All right. I don't ever go any less than seven, uh, any less than 10. So if I do like try and just complete something and I think I'm going to get lucky, 10. But I always try to save up to like 30 or uh, 50. And then I just cash in all of them. Because I'm a free to play player for the most part, you know? But until next time, I'll see you guys later. Peace!